Could wrapping copper wire around the stick really make your plants grow faster and healthier? That's the claim behind electroculture, a gardening method that's been sparking curiosity and controversy. But does it work, or is it just a flashy myth? Thanks to a fantastic challenge by Self Sufficient Me and the Weedy Garden, I'm diving into this experiment myself. They've invited gardeners to try electroculture and share their results, so here's my setup. To keep things fair and scientific, I'm using two identical containers with the same soil mix, plants and watering schedule. The only difference? One container gets the electroculture treatment with copper-wrapped bamboo sticks. The other? Old school gardening, no extras. Electroculture is based on the idea that copper wires can channel the Earth's natural electromagnetic energy to help plants thrive. Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, to test it, I've wrapped copper wire around bamboo sticks and planted them evenly in this container. The theory is that copper antennas will boost nutrient absorption and stimulate growth. But let's be honest, if this works, my plants will probably grow faster than my disbelief. This container will be my control group. Same plants, same soil, same tender loving care, but no fancy copper gadgets. If electroculture works, we should see some real differences between the two. For this experiment, I'm transplanting some leek and spinach seedlings into both containers. They'll grow side by side under identical conditions. Will copper magic give one group a head start? We'll find out. The big reveal will come in February, when I revisit this experiment and compare the results. Will the electroculture container outperform its rival? Or will this technique go straight into my myth farm? Until then, I'll keep watering, watching and sending positive vibes. Curious about electroculture? Or maybe you've tried it yourself? Share your thoughts in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the February results. Who knows, this could be the future of gardening, or the greatest prank ever pulled on a garden nerd like me.